This web video is the latest salvo in an increasingly nasty campaign for president. It comes as Barack Obama continues to widen his lead over John McCain with just 29 days until Election Day. The Obama campaign video criticizes rival McCain for his relationship with convicted thrift owner Charles Keating. 20 years ago, the Senate Ethics Committee cited McCain for poor judgment. From now until Election Day, it may get kind of rough. That is all right. You're in Florida Monday, Republican vice presidential candidate Sarah Palin acknowledged the sharp change in the tone of the race, a change she's played a major role in. For the third day in a row, Palin tried to tie Obama to Bill Ayers, a 60s radical whose group promoted bombings. Barack Obama says that Ayers was just someone in the neighborhood, but that's less than truthful. His own top advisor said that they were, quote, certainly friendly. In fact, Obama held one of his first meetings of his political career in Bill Ayers' living room. The truth is that Obama and Ayers have had only fleeting associations. Palin also told the New York Times that more should be said about Obama's relationship with his former pastor, Jeremiah Wright. She said the relationship between the two men says something about Obama's character. He says our troops in Afghanistan are just air raiding villages and killing civilians. The McCain campaign has a new ad of its own, dangerous. calling Obama dangerous. Obama. Political analyst Thomas Mann says McCain's only hope may be undermining Obama's candidacy. It's a long shot uh, since most Americans are focused now on a very, very bad economy, and they've already concluded that Obama is acceptable for the White House. On Sunday, Obama called the attacks that attempted to distract voters. We are facing the worst economic crisis since the Great Depression, and John McCain wants us to turn the page on talking about the economy. Obama and McCain meet for their second debate Tuesday night. Matt Friedman, The Associated Press.